and he requires 32. Game shot on a fifth leg. Nailed it, and all that's Davidson. gone before has forgotten he's been a lot closer to doubles than that. Davidson can level this match. No score. Aiden, you require 16. I think he thought the second one was in, but it's Kirk comes back. Game Double eight it is, match. and Aiden he wins Kirk. our opening match of the night. It's a 4-2 win in the favour of Aiden Kirk against Ali Davidson. That's the tell of the tape. A very even game in averages, but it's that double count. Four from 17 from Kirk and two from 22 from Daviton. And he was there first on three other occasions. So he'll feel that that's one that maybe has got away. We're going to head into a short break. And when we return, we will have Scott Taylor taking on Ashley Coleman. Break back and level here. Looking to go out in 12. Treble 18 for double 12. Game shot on a third leg. Very, Scott very Taylor. well cleaned up after that. Errant first start from Scott Taylor, who is strutting his stuff. He was unable to do the Brian Ramon there, who we've seen Game going switching to a double Coleman. 13 on a few occasions this week. Strap yourselves in for that one. The Bolton boy doing his hometown proud on the Super Series stage down here in Portsmouth. And that's a lovely leave and a lovely way to leave it. 77. Scott, you require 36. So for a win for the champ. Who's played Good like shot. a champ the match. Scott in his Taylor. opening match of the night. A 4-2 success against Ashley Coleman, but a performance that was as polished as the trophy he lifted at the end of the previous series. Really good stuff. 102.34 the average. Four out of nine on the doubles. A lovely 81 in there for a dozen dart leg for Taylor, who, after losing the opening leg to Ashley Coleman, just ran riot from that point. He'll be back in a couple of games' time. We'll be back after a short break when Trina Gulliver takes on Aidan Kirk. It's on 146, six starts ago. Only on 78. But now double 12. Double six. Game shot on a third leg. Gulliver leads. Trina Gulliver. Now Kirk. One last golden moment for Gulliver in the game. 135. Aiden, you require 70. Well, at least puts her in the picture. Game shot. But not for match. long. Aiden Kirk. As Aiden Kirk defeats Trina Gulliver by that same 4 2 scoreline we've seen in each of the matches so far tonight. An average of 82.25. He follows up the win against Andy Davidson earlier this evening. And Davidson is back in action after the break when he faces Scott Taylor. There is Andy, in that type of form at this particular moment in his career. Oh, it doesn't matter what he leg, does. Andy if Andy Davidson does things like that, respect from the champion. It's draws Andy, I believe. And I'm Scott with the two T's. Well, this is Scott against the Scott, and this John Scott leg, is doing Andy remarkable Davidson. things. He's seen Scott Taylor's level, and he's really, really strong stuff. Game oh, shot on a fabulous, flag. Scott fabulous Taylor. from Scott Taylor, who does have a, a preference for that double 14. Andy require 46. Game shot, and the wow. match. Andy Davidson. What a performance from both players. But in particular, what a performance and what a win for Andy Davidson. The ADC qualifier on his debut week at the Super Series has just taken down the reigning champion. And he's done it despite a 104.54 average from Scott Taylor, who didn't miss a dart at double in that game. Davidson himself only missed one. Started the match with a 160 finish and averaged a staggering 110. You require 85. Rather than worry about things like that, it's, this is what I do, this is how I do it, and I am not changing for anybody. And I like that about him. Bullseye for Trina. Oh, Trina absolutely Trina beautiful. Gulliver. 
18. Trini require 64. Should be looking to get at least one dart at this. Lovely marker. Game shot on a big flag. Trina got Beautifully over. in it. One hundred. Gulliver's taken all Actually the opportunities that she's been offered. You fancy Carmen finishing this off now? Game shot. Which Under he match. duly Ashley does. Coleman. It's a 4-2 victory for Ashley Coleman. And like I say, Gulliver, when she gets her opportunities, she does take those doubles. Two from two from her, but it's Coleman goes out a 4-2 winner. Four from 14 from him. He won't worry about that. It's two points on the league table, which was what he was after. We'll head into a short break and we will return with a big, big match. Aidan Kirk against Scott Taylor. Level 16 then, Scott. So obviously four tops. Game shot. And, and Scott Taylor Scott is Taylor. going loco at the live lounge. A 4-0 win <laughs> over Aidan Kirk. And that is the impressive performance that we've come to expect from our reigning and defending champion. He's actually rubbish compared to everything else he's produced tonight. 95.43. That's about eight points less than his running average before that game. But it is a match. He wins to nil against the man who hadn't lost the game. And that sees Taylor replace Kirk at the top of the table. Coming next, well, blink and you'll miss it. Andy Davidson, Ashley Coleman after the break. Look like a Leeds 82. United shirt oh. from the day. And he walked out to I predict a riot. And Andy and Davidson has run Andy riot Davidson. in this game. A 4-1 thumping of Ashley Coleman in little over seven minutes. An average of 104.79. His second ton-topping average in as many matches. In fact, across his last two games, Andy Davidson is averaging nearly 108 he really has turned on the style and grown in confidence and stature on his first week on the Super Series stage. And he could be a threat comes finals night if he gets there. Currently occupying the top three with Scott Taylor and Aidan Kirk. And Taylor is back on the hockey next when he faces the Golden Girl, Trina Gulliver. Third leg, it's Scott to throw first. Game on. One hundred and eighty. First of this match for Taylor, but it's fifth of the evening. Fifty-five. Is it time? One hundred and eight. Is it time for the nine? He's done just about everything else on the Super Series stage. But now Scott Taylor 59. is three Scott darts Uruguay, away from perfection. Fluffed his lines there. I was getting all excited. Murph was getting all excited. And if that's fluffing your lines, one, two, five, poor commentary. Poor commentary there from me. <laughs> Leaves yourself 16 for a 10 darter. I know a commentator that's done a 10 darter 85. up there, don't I? Scott, you require 16. One or two. He had a little glance up towards the comms box. I think he knew... What kind of thing you'd be saying, Scott? Game shot on the third leg. Scott Taylor. The commentator's normally saying that moment is make sure you still win the leg, and he's done that. Scott, you require 40. I said the 170 would be the perfect way to end his Game night, shot. but in and truth, match. double Scott top Taylor. is the perfect way to end his night because he has been superb on that target. He's been superb overall. It's another 95 average, a 4-1 win for Scott Taylor against Trina Gulliver. Couldn't get the nine-dart finish in the game after back-to-back -back 180s earlier in the match, but he does make it three wins out of four and puts himself in very good shape for another tilt at finals night and a potential return to Champions Week. He will return tomorrow in Group B, but the other four players in the field continue to battle it out tonight. Ashley Coleman in action against Aidan Kirk after this short break. Aidan, you require 118. 118. There we go, then Good top shot. three, Aiden Kirk, Aiden Kirk, who gets a very, very good win. 
4-1 against Ashley Coleman. A great Super Series debut for Aidan Kirk, winning three of his four matches and piling the pressure on Coleman, who's going to have to have a similar campaign himself tomorrow if he's going to get himself into finals night. Kirk is looking in a good position to get there himself. 93.26 the average. The finishing was excellent. Four out of six for him. A 1-1-8 checkout to win the match. A match he wins 4-1. And the last match is coming up next. Trina Gulliver will face Andy Davidson. 100. Yeah, double dose of darts. 1pm back for Group C and then 10pm again for the conclusion of this group. This night may conclude here. Game shot. And, and it match. does. Andy, Andy Davidson, Davidson with a 4-1 win over Trina Gulliver who failed to get a victory tonight. She did get legs in all of her matches. Davidson won three of his four and joined Scott Taylor and Aidan Kirk on six points. And myself and Scott Mitchell will dissect all tonight's action after this short break. <laughs> 